Alright guys, so in Dragon Ball Super Episode 5, there was something interesting that happened that pretty much all of us have missed. And guys, when I say this is really interesting, trust me, this is really, really interesting. And what happened in Dragon Ball Super Episode 5 connects directly to the Terminator Power Goku. In Episode 5, this takes place when Beerus first comes to the world of King Kai. And as we all know, Goku was there at King Kai's planet as well. So guys, the first thing that he did was Super Saiyan Transformation versus Beerus. And guys, as we all have seen, that had no effect on Beerus at all. He was just too much for Super Saiyan. Then guys, Goku transformed into a Super Saiyan 3. And he says, this is Super Saiyan 3, the most powerful. And guys, as Goku and Beerus are still on the ground, they slowly fly up into the sky. And right when they get there, Goku goes directly to attack Beerus. And guys, right when he does that, he retreats immediately before even landing a single touch on Beerus. And guys, even Goku was surprised that his body moved on its own. And he says, what? I retreated. And guys, Beerus was shocked as well. And guys, most importantly, Goku was beyond shocked. He has no idea how that just happened. And right now, Beerus is absolutely amazed and he says, you're very good. In fact, I was just thinking about attacking you a bit. And guys, after that, he also says, if you hadn't retreated, I would have ended your life for sure. And guys, right now, Beerus basically means that if Goku did not stop and move back, he would have pretty much ended the life of Goku. But guys, the thing here is, Goku did not move back after knowing and thinking that Beerus would attack him. Instead, he just moved back on his own, and even Goku was shocked by what his body just did right there. He retreated on his own without even knowing that he actually retreated. Goku's body was automatically able to sense danger and move back all by itself. And guys, at that time, Beerus wasn't even moving a single inch. He was just standing right there and Goku's body was able to sense what was going to happen before it even happened. And the other thing that Beerus here says is, you avoided my blow although you cannot sense the god's energy. And while still being amazed by what Goku just did right there, Beerus asked Goku, are you some kind of genius fighter? Could you be hiding more powers? And guys, the most amazing thing about all this is, all this happened in Dragon Ball Super Episode 5. Although in the beginning, they foreshadowed something that was going to happen much, much later on. And guys, it did. And that was Ultra Instinct. And guys, at first, I thought that this just could be a survival instinct that Goku had. But instead, it was Ultra Instinct because Dragon Ball series as a whole is known about its foreshadowing. They give us small hints on what is going to happen in the future, way back in the past. So guys, in conclusion, in the beginning of Dragon Ball Super, we all have seen Ultra Instinct. And the other thing was, some fans did actually skip the beginning of Dragon Ball Super. Because Dragon Ball Z Battle of Gods and also Resurrection of Frieza was being retold in Dragon Ball Super's beginning. That's where the fans skipped it. But guys, some very interesting things happen in the beginning of Dragon Ball Super that we all have missed. Anyways, you guys, that is about it. That's all I have for you guys today. Do let me know what you guys think about this. Comment section down below. And if you guys have enjoyed this video, then be sure to give it a huge thumbs up. And if you guys are not subscribed just yet, be sure to subscribe for more videos like this. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching and have a blessed day, my friends.